Hi, this is Lou Parker with Smart Label Solutions or SLS RFID Solutions. And the uh, purpose of this video today is to walk through connecting the SmartLink wristband RFID reader. Um, and you can see here it can be worn as a wristband or it can actually be popped out of the wristband if you like and just use as like a desktop reader. Um, you even have like little mounting holes on there. Um, so you can mount it if you wanted to kind of integrate it into a enclosure or mount it to a surface or something like that. You can certainly do that very easily. So to add this is basically a keyboard wedge. So it's going to act like a, a Bluetooth keyboard. Uh, we're doing this in Windows here, but you would open up whatever Bluetooth um, management tool you have. Uh, this supports also could be any operating system really that supports Bluetooth keyboard wedge uh, keyboards, which is pretty much any of them. So the, the process will be somewhat similar for any of them. So you would say, add a Bluetooth or other keyboard device. And then uh, you would say Bluetooth. And it's gonna search for devices. And uh, one of the devices that should appear, I've turned on the, uh, the, the, the uh, SmartLink keyboard wedge version here, right? So it will appear here as Physicom, that's just the Bluetooth chipset that's inside of it to connect to. So we'll just highlight that. And there won't actually be any number appearing on the device itself, but so we'll just say connect. This is just assure, assuring us that we're connecting to a unique device. So we'll say connect and your device is ready to go. So once we've done that, um, there's kind of the concept of now associating uh, items uh, with a RFID number. So here we have, for example, our Smart View software. This is a Smart Label Solution software called Smart View. And I'm logged in here and I'm gonna now associate some items. So I just got a simple sample test tag here. And so the item might be like 00063 or something. So I might fill that in here manually with my keyboard or I could barcode scan it for example, and now for the RFID component, now I want to associate and say, anytime I read this RFID tag, it knows it's that item number, as well as all this other information that we have available for entering in it. And we call this associating. So I'll just go ahead and put my keyboard widget, and we see that it just filled it in there again, just as if it beeps, let me know it read a tag, and it just input it automatically into the into that field, that RFID field, as if it would come from a keyboard wedge, to, uh, from a keyboard basically. So that's as simple as it gets. You just simply, uh, again, you add the, you turn on the device, you go into your settings and uh, add it as a, add it as a keyboard, as a Bluetooth keyboard. So like we can see here that we are now um, paired with it, with that Fizicom device. And, uh, and then once you do that, now it will act as a keyboard wedge. So you can do this in any, I showed in it, but in really any, there's there's Word or just some notepad or whatever, or Excel or whatever you want to output it to. But just the idea that now you can easily read a RFID tags as if it's other coming from a, a keyboard. Thank you very much.